Hey everybody, I just woke up from a nap with my kids and I went to look outside and I had this sitting here waiting. And I immediately knew who it was from because of all this awesome duct tape around the edges, you know, that stuff is never going to fall out. It's uh, from West Coast Picks here, did a trade, but uh, yeah, let me get it open and see what we got in here. So hopefully I can figure out where the edges are. This thing is taped up like Fort Knox in here. Of course I'm using a dull blade. Let's see if my other cutter is a little better. Just a little bit tired here. Finally got a nap in. Been a long week. Just uh, well, yesterday was really busy. Running around with the kids everywhere. Went to an old uh, Boy Scout troop reunion, so that was pretty fun. But work right after. I think we got it mostly. Alright, yeah, so he's gonna send a bunch of locks, so let's take a look what we got here first. We have a uh, challenge lock here. Let's see. Challenge lock by gantry. Cool, I've never had a gantry challenge lock before. A little schleg here. He's got his name on it. Supposed bidding, but you know, you can never believe that. <laughs> And then the top is JB welded on there, so you know he's been in the top to do something. Awesome. Looks like a yeah five pin lock here. Get that stuff put back in the bag here. Awesome, man. Thank you. It's the first gantry. I have a bunch of people's uh, first time challenge locks I need to get picked. And pretty much all of them. Like I said it's been a busy week and the kids have started school too, so it's been a lot going on around the house here lately. Got another little schleg, <laughs> twerking tension wrench. And this one is pinned by Pikmin 1977, awesome. So there's gotta be some kind of spools in here or something, I'm pretty sure I've seen this lock before, but I'm not good at remembering what's inside of any locks, except for my own pretty much, so. Awesome. I have a, that's the next lock I need to get on camera is the one uh, Pikmin sent himself. Me, I should say. And I've got another little schleg here, pinned by. This one is called Revenge of the Underdog, pinned by Ryan M. That's pretty crazy bidding on there. Another little schleg. I've seen these types of uh, types of locks quite a bit. Never picked one either though. Very nice. Cool. Get that one back in its bag. I'm really gonna have to make sure I keep all this stuff organized. I have so many locks sitting around here right now. We got a a Yale. Let me get this one. Ah, cool. It's a the dragon. I've seen these all over. This will be the first one I've ever gotten. That's badass. This one is called the uh, Yale Old Dragon. Another. Well, obviously it's a pick me lock. If you guys know the dragons. And, yep, mummy key as usual. That's oh, really awesome. Thank you. Two picking locks so far. There could be even more. You never know. Oh man, I'm pretty sure is. I don't want to say. I think it was a potty lock, but I don't quite remember. Oh, it's a den brass. I think it was potty who picked it the first time, that's right. I just remember this uh, this wicked key. You can expect something like that from Den Brass. That's really awesome. A snake lock, let's get that out. Pretty sure I've seen a few people pick on this one. I don't even know which way the key goes in the first. Let's see. Yeah, there we go. Wow, that works really awesome. That's a cool key. 
Got a couple den brasses I need to pick here as well. I think that'll be the next one I put on. I have another one I got from, uh, it was a late night lock picker, I think, way back in the day. Almost cleared all of his out of here. And here we have some West Coast picks. Awesome. Another schleg. I've been practicing on them, so they're getting easier for me. Let's see. This one is called the Incubus. And it says Lawrence on the key, but we have a mummy key here, so who knows what we'll find inside of that. Pretty known for making really tough locks, so we'll see what we're getting ourselves into here. We got another West Coast picture leg. Let's get this one out of here, too. I like how he even matches his uh, his tags to the to the tape. Pretty awesome. <laughs> yeah, another little schleg. What is the name of this one? I didn't look. One is the Typhoon or Typhon. Sorry, not the Typhoon. West Coast picks. Nice. I think I see uh, there might be another one back there. Oh, he said he makes at least one challenge lock a day, pretty much. I don't know if he still does, but let's see. And here we have Tragdor. Trogdor. Sorry, I can't talk today. <laughs> but West Coast picks. I'm going to have to look up what that even means. Because I know sometimes when I name my locks certain things, I have to keep them. I probably don't even know what the heck it is, but... <laughs> Alright, thanks man. That's a lot of West Coast pick stuff right there. That thing looks crazy. Alright, I already know what it is pretty much, but let's take a look. It's uh, we got a Trek Master 30. Doesn't have a name on there, but heavily mummied key. And it is a Schlage Everest. That's awesome. I don't know if you can see in the back through there. I need to make a shotgun or something for one of these, but I don't know. The pick will work just fine in the meantime. See the check pin is back over there in that corner, so it can't be too hard to get to. I'm sure it just sticks out at an angle or something. I have one other Everest I need to pick. It's a Bill Bacardi Schlage Everest as well. But that's awesome, thanks man. And last but not least, no, yeah, we'll see. I'm pretty sure that's just uh, stuffing in the bottom, but we'll make sure. Because uh, he did say on the package eight locks. Let's count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. No, we got nine in here. Thank you. And this one is a Euro cylinder challenge lock, which is really cool. I have a Euro cylinder, but not a Euro cylinder challenge lock, and this one is. Another West Coast picks. Effer Hilda, West Coast picks. That sounds Norse to me. I want to say <laughs> that's why I'm gonna have to look some of these words up. It's been a while since I've taken uh, mythology, but that's really cool. And I know he's actually used some uh, Norse names before, so I could, I wouldn't doubt it. Cool. And that is a uh, one, two, three, five pen euro. Of course we can't see the key, so who knows what the heck is going on in there. That's a lot of West Coast Picks locks. But uh, yeah, thanks guys. Thanks for uh, thanks for watching. Thanks for doing a trade with me, West Coast Picks. I appreciate it. Let me just make sure there's nothing stuffed in the bottom here. Yep, just stuffing. Okay, we didn't miss anything. But uh, yeah, I really got some picking to do. But yeah, thanks again for the trade and thanks for watching guys. Till next time, I'll talk to you later. Bye.